How's it going, guys? 07 Adam here. Let me just correct myself in my seat. And welcome to Don't Open Your Eyes. Now, this game is fully just like creep out humor just because of the way you don't get chased by a monster in this game. There is a monster, but he talks to you the entire game, right? It's really unsettling. And this game is, I think, this might be like a 20, 25 minute, maybe at most 30 minute video. Or maybe not even 30 I think it might only be like 20 minutes just just for this game but it is very creepy and I'm not gonna cut any like of the audio I'm not gonna cut any um well I'm gonna there there may be a few cuts but it's only gonna be for, if I take like a screenshot of something that's creepy I'll take a screenshot and make that the thumbnail you know but anyways let's get right into don't open your eyes It's getting light. My eyelids have begun to feel heavy. I better go to sleep. Uh, you know what? That's that's a smart decision. I live or I leave aside the book I've been reading and look out my window. The process of falling asleep is always a struggle against the noise, barking dogs, police sirens, or even my own intrusive thoughts. Dude, I have so many. I just get a shit ton of intrusive like intrusive thoughts when I try to go to bed. Not even the turning gears of my brain are pursue are producing much sound. Tonight is just oddly quiet. Quiet. Uh-huh. Too quiet. Well, you should go to bed. I feel restless. You should go to bed. My sight veers towards the hallway outside my room. The distance between my room and the opposite wall is only ten steps long. I know since I've made a habit of counting them whenever I'm out, or whenever I go out. One, two, three. At, at best, bro. At, at best, absent. I just realized it's just absent mindedly. Why, why was I thinking abdestmently or something like that? Absent mindedly, but always. I don't know why. Maybe it's just being. Maybe I just like being aware of all my surroundings to the smallest details. But tonight is different. The hallway looks like it stretches into nothingness, like the throat of a gargantuan, gargantuan beast. Logical thinking cries that it's just my imagination. There can't be anything wrong or different about it. It's just a hallway, but... But what? I don't want to look at it. Yeah, we have a huge dark. <sighs> Sorry about that yawn. Look, I just like to... So I just take a deep breath and close my eyes. You should close them. You should go to bed right now. You should go to bed. Bye bye. Good night. Have a have sweet dreams. In my room. Mm hmm. There's a bed. In my room. Is that a closet? There's oh, a wardrobe in my room. Paintings or pictures? Paintings, pictures, pictures framed on the wall. Okay. And my room is a part of my shelf. Or my room is a part of my shelf. It's a world I know like the back of my hand. Where someone to blindfold me and ask me to find my way around. I do so without the slightest difficulty. As long as nothing changes, leaving my eyes closed makes no difference. In this room, I can always find what I want to find. Because in this room... I know how everything looks. I need to wake up early tomorrow. I should, you shouldn't go to sleep, man. That's what I, that's exactly what I'm saying. One. Uh oh. Somebody's walking in. Two. Leave those ten. Three. What's that sound? Four. Are those footsteps? Five. Six. No, that's impossible. It must be my, my imagination. Seven. But it's getting closer. Eight. And closer. Nine. One more. Ten. He is here. And closer. Also, this is this is like a horror ASMR game. I don't like ASMR, so if you don't like ASMR, don't watch this video. 
it's like it's like weird in my ears so it's this is like a little creepier for me because i just hate it right now there's nowhere someone could be here mm. but there is our man those are the big cheese oh i keep on yawning what the hell hey hey buddy open your eyes yeah i'm good do I open them? No, I do not. I don't open my eyes. I don't wanna. Open your eyes. No. Look at me. I wanna. I do my best to ignore the voice. Why won't you look at me? Because you look like a freaking mutated spaghetti is. noodle. If a stranger asks for help, is it right to ignore? Them. Yes. Is that how it is? Yes. I can feel someone breathing over my ear. It's cold. I will share a secret with you. <laughs> I'm listening. I have never seen myself before. Really? I don't know if my face is ugly. Mm -hmm. I don't know the color of my skin. I mean, you could see that by just looking at your like hand. You I know? don't know if I'm even here. Okay. That is why. I'm good. So you can tell me how I look. No, I'm good. But I'm also shy. Yeah. Oh, self voicing. Self voicing enabled. Oh, no, self voicing disabled. I'm sorry about that. So I might hide the moment you do. I'm you good. Find me anywhere. I didn't realize that was an option. You will forget. I want to forget right now. Uh, it's faded already. I'm fading away. I know you're not asleep. I I know I'm not either. You listen with those tiny. Tiny? How, they look so how do you know they're fragile. tiny? Like yeah. I could almost grab them. Yeah. I feel something caress my ear. Put my fingers around them. Mm-hmm. And tear them off. You know, me personally, I wouldn't like that. I feel like if you ripped off my ears, that would be a disappointment. That'd be disappointing. If I do, will you scream? Uh, oh, I'm moving my, I'm moving my mic. So if you just heard all that, sorry about that. Um, yes, I would scream. Will I hear your voice. You would hear my voice. I'd be. Oh my God! You're ripping my ears off! Oh my God! Joke. Dude, <laughs> hilarious, bro. I'm joking. Again, hilarious. Don't be scared. I'm not. I still want you to leave, though. Hey, yeah. How do you think my eyes look? Oh. Uh, case is finally me. Why am I yawning so much? Um, answer me. Answer. Your eyes look. Your eyes look broken. Look broken. Yes. Mmm. I don't. I do not like that. It may be so. Mm -hmm. I'm always straining my sight to stare at what's in front of me, mm -hmm. searching for that one precious thing. It's what drives me to look inside places. Really? But sometimes I strain so hard. Uh -huh. Little pieces seem to fall off my face. I don't think that's After healthy. Another, like if your eyes... Sound as they go. If your eyes are falling out of your face, that's I typically not good. Like... That's not eyes. In my desperation, I always attempt to piece them back together. Yeah. I kneel and search for the missing fragments of myself. Me sad. Why does it make you sad? So sad. I put my hands where my eyes should be. Mm -hmm. And I borrow my fingers. Ooh. And I take it out. You shouldn't do that. I take everything out. You really shouldn't do that. Every little piece that remains hard. You really? Furiously. You shouldn't. And wallowing in sorrow. Well, you're wrong because you're ripping your eyes out, man. I pray to whoever's listening to give back what's mine. I'm listening and do I don't have it. Me lose more than I've already lost. Mm. I don't want to waste my time and search for more than I care for. Yeah. Yet no one delivers. You know what game I was thinking about playing recently? No one is listening. It was a uh, Destiny 2 cuz I remember when I first got when Destiny 2 came out, I played the Red War. That game was that was awesome. I, I liked it. Invisible tears. So I might play some Destiny 2 later cuz I think it's free. 
Yeah. Have you ever strained yourself so hard to see what you want to see that you end up blinding yourself to all? Huh. Like, figuratively, I guess. Like, I, I've, I've had times where I've, I wanted something so bad that I take the hard option because that's the first one that's visible to me. Even though the easier and probably safer option was next to it, I was just, like, tunnel visioned to that harder option because I thought that was the right decision. It's happened to me before with, like, relationships with friends, loved ones, school, just every day, you know? Have you? Video games, I have. These eyes. I mean, silent, by the way. Yeah. Are these? Dude, these eyes. sound like your eyes. Good answer. Mm hmm. Yet, there is only one way to know the truth. What's the truth that we need to know? Open your eyes. Dude, <laughs> bro, I would, but like, I'm allergic to my eyes being open. So you won't look at me. I, dude, it's, it's, not, it, it's not like a thing I want. Even though your eyes are so pretty. I thank, I thank you for the compliment. But as you can clearly see, if I open my eyes, they will actually combust into flames, and then I won't even be able to see you, and then I don't have eyes. So I like, can't see them, but I can imagine them behind their veil of flesh. Weird compliment, but I'll take round it. Like pearls. They are pretty round. Shiny like jewels. I know a kid at school that has cube eyes. It's pretty weird. So so pretty. Again, thank you. Don't 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 breathe. Don't don't breathe on my eyelashes. It's fine. We still have time. Yeah. The night is still and silent. It is pretty silent. Don't breathe on my. I'm ask politely one more time that you don't breathe on my. Stop that, dude. Bro, big cheese. Big cheese. My big squeeze. Okay. People are good at closing their doors. Yeah. I do. Typically made out of wood. They're on like hinges, right? They got a handle. You know, you open the door, and then it's like you go in there. You go in there, and yeah, you walk in. You know, you talk to people. You go on your phone. You go to bed. Of course, you know. You have one right there at the verge of your little world. Uh, dude, I know about that door. You you actually oh, walked right through it. To Mm, it's also like to keep like, like farts, my dog. The bad you know, anything. A bad person. A bad smell. Bad smell. Farts. This guy gets it. Sometimes. Me. I mean, as long as you don't hurt me, I guess you're chill. I can't open doors. You can't. I find them tricky. I mean, I'll teach you. Just don't like kill me. Should I push? Depending on the door, it's they're mainly pull they're mainly push doors. I think most go in the comments really quick. Is is there mainly push or pull doors? Because I feel like it's push. I feel like I only see pull doors at like like 7-Eleven or like just gas stations. I don't really see them at like a house or anything. Houses are typically have push doors. Should I turn the knob left or right? Doesn't matter. It's still open the door. Should I try? You could, but it would be hard. Should I chip away at it? Hoping it will fall apart. Again, you could, but it'd be hard. And what happens when it opens? You walk through. Do I close it behind me? Well, not if you chipped your way through it, silly. Do I keep it open? Not if you open up the hinges. But well, that might be rude either. to the person who had it closed. And you can keep it. I mean, I don't think I really think it matters. Then, how do I get out? Through the chipped hole that you made. Well, again, if you chipped your way through it, you can just walk through. So many options. Not really. So many things that could go wrong. Oh, you're good. Whenever I stand in front of a closed door, it paralyzes me. Really? I stare at it for a long time. Mm-hmm. And think of my excuses. Mm-hmm. Because that's all they are. What bothers me the most about closed doors is the idea they exist uh -huh. to keep me out. I mean, not to keep you out, it again. Me with the need they're mostly to keep to go in. 
They mostly they keep bad smells out like farts, like he mentioned. So I searched like for I mentioned. Crevice. Like we both mentioned. Because we're such good friends. Anything that might be open. Anything that might let me in. I'm not good with doors. But as long as there's a place where I can fit. Every night, I hop across the shadows of the streets. I'm careful. So as to not be caught by the light. Dude. I, my eternal search, you gotta get some some like some sunlight on you, like every once in a while, you know. I slip in and spend the night wherever is comfortable. Usually, it's a cellar, an attic, anywhere with dust, with dirt. Oh, guys! I should also mention I found a way to full screen tabs. It's a F11 for anybody that wants to know. So that means I can probably full screen it for it become human. The, so that it's better for like a viewing wise for you guys, right? So I mean, hey, we, we found I found a pretty good win, and that's that's what I'm doing for all these games because they're on ta uh, they're like a tab game. I feel that hole there, dude. Cool. But sometimes, yeah. Just sometimes, uh -huh. an urge swells inside of me. What's that? The urge to be seen. I mean, so I search hard. Yeah. For a door that's open. Yeah. For an entryway covered in darkness. Uh huh. Someone to be at the other end. Right. Oh, as if expecting me. Dude, I was not expecting to be honest, I was not expecting you to be here. Because you're built like a golf club. And I don't really fuck with that, you know? But you won't look at me. I won't. Even though you had your toe ropes for visitors. Somehow I know what your silhouette is without looking at you. Why is that? Uh because you're weird. Are you? Of you, yes. Do I scare you? Yes. No. That can't be it. But that's what it is. We have been chatting for so long. You've been talking for so long. You haven't chased me out. I don't want to die. That means you welcome me. No, I just don't want to die. So I'm certain that if I were to reach out my hand. Yeah. Oh. You would reciprocate and grasp it. No, not really. I'm sure your hands are warm. <laughs> Thank you. So very warm. <laughs> Again, thank you. My hands are very warm. Because people are always warm. No. Some people have, like, cold hands. Just for, like, no... Like, it can be... I'm in Flor... I live in Florida, right? It can be, like, 97 out. And I'll, like... I'll, like, shake somebody's hand, and it's freaking, like, frigid. I don't know what they're doing, right? It's weird. Hey. Yeah. How do my hands... Look. I don't know. finally meets yours, how will it feel? Answer me. Um, I'm gonna say your hand, uh, look tired, deceitful, and incomplete. I'm gonna say your hands, you, listen, you have pretty broken eyes, so I'm gonna say you probably have some incomplete looking hands. Look incomplete. Yeah. Mmm, I, I don't like that, to be honest. To, to be frank. That may be so. Yeah. Amidst my travels, I have lost more than I can imagine. Mm-hmm. Chat companions. Dude, I don't want to. Like I don't want to be your chat companion. I don't want to so be your buddy. No wonder that by leaving them behind, I'm not your bait. All right. I will think such as skin. I didn't mean to skip that. I'm sorry about that, guys. Yes, skin. Or flesh. I can or tell. Bones, I can or tell. Anything that makes me, me. Yeah. Yes. Farewell gifts. You could say. Dude, that is so. Like an that is so chill. And that's because. Yeah. Because I am careless and overly curious. Mm hmm I can't help but wonder how everything feels to the touch. Yeah. Like the crust of a tree. Or the surface of a frozen lake. Uh tree's probably like either like warm or cold and it's like all that you know, like like crusty. Frozen ice, it's probably just like frigid, solid, maybe a little bit like I guess like bumpy here and there because water is like it's not fully flat when it freezes but sometimes i find something else yeah like a building engulfed in a raging fire oh i think of the screams in the distance or the suffering and death and charred skin yeah and wonder how does that feel bad so i put my hands to the fire oh it hurts but i tolerate it and to keep them there dude you need to go see a doctor to be honest, and probably because your freaking hands are melted. The smell of charred skin starts protruding from my own. Probably because they're off your bones. Take them out. The feeling persists. 
Yeah, because your hand, you, you fucking burn the shit out of your hands. That horrible, but intoxicating feeling. In oh, this guy's freaky. I don't like it. I seek such extreme sensations. Don't. The edge of a knife sometimes provides it. Yeah. Other times, the fangs of a beast. Mm. Most times, however, it's by mere accident. I would place my fingers over a benign surface. To discover it's covered in spikes. Yeah. And I will leave my hands there as I traverse along it. Dude, don't leave your hands on spiky shit. Leaving parts of my body as a farewell gift. Oh, so it's like freaking uh, Easter eggs. I get it. In that sense, <laughs> it's not so different from what I was saying uh -huh. before. The fire and the blades are friends. Yeah. They have granted me times of great fun. You shouldn't be having fun though. So, it's only polite to leave something of yours as a sign of thanks. Like? But there's one thing I've always loathed from these encounters. Like what? They're always painful. Yeah, because you're stabbing- you're either stabbing the shit out of your hand, you're burning it, or you're scraping it. Of course it's gonna suck. I'd rather they weren't. You can find textures like that that aren't painful. Um, I found cloth like, like like weighted blankets that feeling that's pretty good on my hands um smooth like like really smooth objects that like they don't stick to your hands so that's always a, that's always fun um what else yeah r r really for me it's just like smooth stuff and like fabrics are good are good feelings for my hands um i like to fidget with like keep my keyboard and stuff so I don't know, find a keyboard in a dumpster and just click click the buttons. Hey, for you, man. Like that's that's what I would do. Have you ever placed yourself in arms way? Yes. Only to feel the satisfaction you've realized is not yours. No. Have you? No. I remain silent. These hands. Yeah. Are these? Dude. My hands. They are totally your hands. I'm good. No. So you won't look at me. Yep. Even though my hands could be the same as yours. My hands do not look like that. Think about it. Mm -hmm. Maybe you and I are similar. We are not. No. I know we are. We are not. I can feel it in my skin. You don't have a lot of skin left, apparently. Your skin should not pulsate. Hmm. Oh. Can you hear it? Yeah. My skin is pulsating. Dude, go see a doc. Skin should not pulsate. It has been long. At least not all of it. Since this happened. Oh yeah? What? It's a sign of my innermost emotions flowing out. Mm hmm I wander the world, wanting to be seen. Mm hmm I'll be satisfied as long as someone tells me how I look. Dude, I'll let you ha I'll let you know how you look later, but, but not right now. It's not like anyone will do. Yeah? If it did, then it would be oh so easy. Uh huh. Since I could show myself to everyone at once. Every living person in this land. Yeah. And ask them all the same question. What's that? Someone will answer. There's no doubt about it. Oh, what's that question? But it might not be the answer I wish for. Yeah, don't always expect what you think is the answer to be the answer. Since I don't want to be judged, mm -hmm. I don't want to be perceived as something I'm not. I mean, you have broken eyes and broken arms or it hands. It scares me. Yeah. That is why, when someone is on the verge of looking at me, I shy away. Oh, you have anxiety? I have that too, man. I hide, fading into the dark. Ugh. But you... Might be different. I'm not different. I want you out of my house. If it's you, it might be possible to stand still, if only for a second. Okay. That way you can help me, and we can both be fulfilled. I'm already fulfilled. I want you out of my house. Just thinking about it, it makes me feel. Feel what? Stop. Stop with the pulsating. Feel. Stop with the pulsating skin, bro. Something. Yeah. I cannot describe it. I am not good with words. 
Hey, that's fine. There was a person in my past. Yeah. Who taught me to speak like a person. Oh, who's that? They were not good at it either. Uh -huh. And thinking back on it, they certainly didn't enjoy it. Oh, uh, how did you know? To teach a wordless being how to talk must be a challenge. I mean, to, to teach a person that looks like you in general must have been a challenge. They did. Simply yeah. because they could. It is weird to remember. No, it's not. Because it makes me think of why I want to be seen. Yeah, I mean, I guess, but... And yeah. I am not. Sure. Oh, come on, buddy. I don't care much for my appearance. No, come on, buddy. I don't want to be judged. Yeah. But if that were it, I could easily stay out of sight. So why is it? Why do I want someone to recognize me so much? Uh, you've never seen yourself and you want to be recognized. Maybe it's only because I can. No, maybe, probably. Because everyone gets to be recognized. Uh-huh. But I will. Yeah, you will, buddy. Soon. You will very sure. Soon. Oh, show sham. Show sham. I'm not gonna open my eyes because you have pulsating uh, skin. There it is again. Yeah. Just thinking about the moment you unveil your sight onto me. Dude, chill out, bro. And you finally take, take a it chill pill, broski, okay? And you inspect every crevice of mine. What do you mean by that? And you finally, finally, finally open those tight lips of yours. Bro. I, I don't I don't swing that way, okay? I, I don't listen, I respect you for your choice and how you wanna live, but I don't swing that way personally. So I respectfully decline and I hope you find somebody in your life, okay? To let me hear what I am. You want me to open my lips so that I can I can hear you right now, bro. I don't have to do that. And to maybe even give me a name. Um you're okay, you know what? If it if it makes you leave, your name is Um Your name is Thomas. Yeah. I don't know what. Yeah, I'm going. You, you, you look like a Thomas. For anybody that knows Thomas in real, a Thomas in real life, this is a Thomas, okay? Surely it would be evident if you were to look at my face. I can see it apparently. Hey, Already, yeah. What does my expression look like? Um. That veil of uncertainty finally disappears. What will we convey to each other? Let's see. Answer me. A cheerful smile, surprise, a grimace, an emotionless stare. I feel like you're probably gonna be a little bit cheerful because I'm seeing your face for the first time. A cheerful smile. Yes. I that you know what that's pretty that's pretty cheerful. That may be so. Yeah. It would only make sense for the end of this journey to bring me joy. Mm hmm It has been so so long. Super long, bro. I can this this episode actually might be a little bit longer than thirty minutes. Can, but who's to say it had a beginning? Me. Maybe the starting point is that faint memory. Faint memory's me. It's all the me. The earliest one I can recall. I'm the earliest one you can recall. I was walking. Uh huh. And for some reason, it was daytime. Huh. I rarely travel during the daytime. Yeah. Only when the fear of being seen isn't there. So I must have believed. That was the case. Huh. But it's strange. Why is it strange? Since the place I was walking through was a city. Yep. One full of people. Mm -hmm. I couldn't see them. But I knew they were there. Yeah. Hiding in the shadows. With their backs against the dirt. Completely motionless. Completely silent. Living in weight of their deaths. And what's more, none dared to look at me. Did they even know I was there? Maybe they did not care. All I remember is feeling a certain kinship towards the hidden inhabitants of that settlement. Yeah. They were like me. No, dude, if if a group of people looked like you, I would not I would okay, I I would I would hire Elon Musk to make me a rocket ship. So that I can then go to Mars and colonize it and live by myself for the rest of my life just to not be near that. Living in fear of what others might think. Dude, I think you look bad. And who's to say I was 
You need you need to I don't know maybe get like a facelift, get a wig, some gloves to cover up your bony fingers. Um, you need to get your teeth done. Maybe get some glasses to cover up your eyes. You'd be all good. Maybe I spent my days as part of the scenery as well. Uh huh. And one day I decided to go for a walk. Huh. A walk that hasn't yet found its end. It's my earliest memory. Are you a lamp? And my most joyful hmm? one. Are you a bush? Are you a statue? What do you mean by that? No experience afterwards. Are you a bench? Are you, are, are you just like a stick? I don't know, man. So if you say I am smiling, then surely that's how it must be. Dude, your smile looks sick. But tonight, I'm not joyful. Why is that? So if my expression is truly one of cheer, mm -hmm. then I must be lying through my smiling teeth. You are. Hey, yeah. Have you ever expressed honest happiness in your face? Oh, dude, a bunch. Hmm, um, ooh, tough question, um, I think that's happened a few times, maybe, I think it was only happened for me like maybe two or three times in my life that I've ever had, I've ever smiled when in reality I was sad or angry, but no, no, not really. Have you? Typically when I'm angry, I, I show I'm angry. I do remain silent though, look this at that. expression. Yeah. Is this? Dude. Expression. My bro, my big cheese, that is your expression. See, yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. You have truly helped me tonight. Of course, man, of course. These are my eyes. Yup. These are my hands. Correct among you. And this is my expression. Yes, sir. I consider these my most treasured features. And you're welcome because I figured out what they are for you. And you have helped me picture them all. Dude. You're welcome. Now leave my house. No one has done this for me. Dude, I I, I, I wonder why. A connection with you. Oh, don't say that. One born out of honest gratitude. Oh, uh, don't say that. But there's one step left. Yep. You need to make sure of the truth. Okay. It is the only way yep. to finally understand each other. Okay. So please, I beg of you. Yes. Okay, you know you know what we're gonna do? Uh, let me just close those down. You guys can see what I'm, I'm gonna get a coin flipper. Okay. I'm gonna get coin flipper right here, right? And we're gonna flip. Heads I open my eyes, tails I don't, okay? I don't open my eyes, apparently. Dude, my big cheese. I'm good. No. no, I don't. I don't open my eyes. I see. Mm -hmm. I understand. Yeah. No, it's fine. Mm -hmm. You have still helped me by answering my questions. You're welcome. No one has done that for me before. Dude, of course. So I have no right to ask for anything else. Thank you for understanding. Is the camera zooming in? No. Oh no, it wasn't. Okay. That is a lie. What is a lie? Ever since I stepped into this room. Yeah. You have refused to engage with me. I've literally showed you what your hands, mouth, and eyes look like. Not even once. I've been talking to you this entire time. Not even once. 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 You can show. I've been talking to you. Not even once. Did you open your eyes? I can see without my eyes. I'm like some sort of X Men. I don't know how I'm doing it. But I know what it looks like. You stayed there, acting as if you were asleep, mm -hmm. feigning ignorance and not moving an inch. At times, making me believe that our conversation was just in my head. I mean, kinda. You're 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 in a video game, and I'm not. So you haven't opened your mouth. I didn't need to. But you didn't need to. Again, I didn't need to. I can hear far, far beyond what most others can. You can hear me. Thank you. And I can see further than what others would consider the you dark. Can... Empty bottom. You can see me, big priest. That's why mm -hmm. I, that I wasn't wrong. You're not wrong. You are like me. I don't look like that. We are the same. I no. You too. Look for what's not there. I don't. You too. Reach out for what might hurt you. Nope. And you too are a liar. 
I'm not a liar, bro. The type that shows one thing <laughs> and feels another. I don't know what you're talking about. But you made a mistake. What was that? I know you're lying. How do you know? Because every answer you've given me so far uh -huh. has been wrong. What do you mean? I am not what you said I am. These eyes, these hands, this expression. Yeah. What? 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 They aren't mine. Why'd you make me do all that then? Maybe they are yours. N no, to be I honest. I do not care. Maybe the eyes and hands. Like, uh, from I what you were saying, what they were, but not the hand. Or the eyes and mouth, not the hands. Uh, hands are no way. Open your eyes. No. I didn't want to be judged. I'm judging you right now, nerd. I didn't want to be perceived for something I'm not. You're a nerd. And that's all you did. Yeah. So now, you will open your eyes. No, I won't. And see me for what I truly am. And what's that? You said so. No, I didn't. That in this room, you know how oh, everything looks. That's what you mean. It was those words that brought me here. Mm-hmm. So you have to. No, I don't. You have to do right by that which you claim. No, I don't. This time. No, it's not. Open your eyes. I don't wanna. Mm, no. Open your eyes. Um, no. Open your eyes. Ice. Um. Okay. Coin flip around to again heads. If it's heads, we open them. Tails, I don't. You know what? Screw it. I'm still. I'm open my eyes. You had your chance. What? It's not up to you anymore. You don't want me to open them anymore. Yeah. I will. I was just about to. Mmm. Something curls are- oh, coiling around my head. To the pressure on my skull's under- oh, you're crushing me right now, aren't you? I hear something shatter. Oh, and my life's fading. Ah, uh, your eyes are as beautiful as I imagined. I can't see you, though. Tell me, my new friend. Yeah? What do you see? I see darkness. I want to answer, but they've grabbed me in my head and won't let me talk. But I, but what I see, what I see is what? Oh, two X. Oh, I see some. I saw. Uh oh, I think I might have fucked up. So he's a blur. I close my eyes. That won't do. Yeah. You're just gripping my Open shit right now, aren't you? Huh? No, I already did. Oh. Open them. Yep. If you stop open crushing my head, all. I can. Open, open, open. Open, open, open. Boom, boom, boom. Open, 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 open. Dude, sick song right now. Yeah. It seems I did it again. Yeah, you killed me. You can't see anymore, right? I can't. You can't talk anymore, right? You broke my jaw. You can't think anymore. You smushed my brain. Then, this is farewell. Uh, see you later, nerd. Thank you for trying, you, friend. Dude, you're welcome. Even though you are a liar. I'm not a liar. I leave this piece of myself here with you. Thank you. Big heart. Big heart. Thank you. Must go. See you later, or not? Because I'm, I'll right be dead. Person. Yeah. Someone who can tell me how I look. Okay. Someone who can explain to me uh -huh. why everyone looks like that when they do. Because you beat the shit out of me. Of course I would look like that when you kill me. Because you beat the shit out of me. Five. Oh, I only had four footsteps. Oh, no dots. There's something in my hand. It's what they left behind. What is it? It feels important. What did he leave? But I can no longer open my eyes. Uh, 
Like, this was a pretty good... This, this was a good game. Very scary. Fucking hated it, but it was awesome. Um, music? What music? Anyways. Uh, very scary game. 40 minutes? Damn. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this hella long episode. But, uh, this has been 07 Adam. Peace.